Hi guys, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. So we have successfully completed the Vue.js Composition API with Pinia. So let's have a quick overview of this one. So what are the concepts that we have learned? If you open this playlist, so this is our playlist. And if you try to open this playlist, so we have learned the basics of this one. So what is view 3 and what is the difference between the composition API and the options API and we have how to create a new project. So like this we have learned. So in this one the important concepts are about the component, how to create a component and what are the difference between refs and the reactive variables and also the reactive thing and also what I can say is the nested components, how to send the data from one component to another component like props. And also from child to parent, we have seen like event emitters, define emits. Entirely the syntax is different when compared to the view to. That is the main thing. And also the computer property, how to define it within the composition API. And also the watcher property, what difference between watch and the watch effect. So these are also the watch post effect. These are all the uh, differences we have learned it. And life cycle hooks, this is also one of the important concept in the composition API. And another one is the template refs. So function refs and all those things we have learned it when you pass a VFN model to a component what will happen also we have seen it and what I can say and another thing is the <coughs> component VFN model we have seen it and uh, what I can say com uh, this, this is the thing composables we have learned about the composables also composables also is one of the important concept in view 3 and you already know about the slots named slots and all those things also you know you know about those things and other than this one custom directives we have learned and la and, and another one comes in the animations we have learned about the animations how to do the animations and all those things in the Vue.js and some of the important concepts that are introduced in the view 3 like teleport keep alive these are all the things we have learned it so this is all of the basic core concepts in the Vue.js then after we have moved to the view routing so view router we have understood we have, we have we have learned about how to install the view router for library so how, how we can use this dynamic root matching, root matching, 404 pages, name root roots, programmatic navigations, router.push, router.replace and also we have learned about the name root views, these are all the things, passing row props to the routing thing and we have learned about the navigation guards like global global guards, before reach, after reach like this, before resolve and before enter, so the, these are route, route guards we have seen it and also the component based routing guards we have seen it. Then afterwards we have shifted to the state management pattern which is a new one introduced in view 3 that is Pinia. So view 4 is nothing but a Pinia only. We have learned what is what is the difference between Pinia and also view 4. What are the difference between those two which one we need to use it. So those concepts also we have learned. So in the Pinia we have seen how to create a store, how to create the state. These are all the things we have seen it. So how we can use it for the options, how we can create the state store for in options api and also in the composition api the pinia thing we have seen it everything we have learned about the computer properties like getters actions these are all the things we have learned then afterwards we have created a simple composition api project like notes list project we have created we have created it and we have used the simple CRUD operations like add edit delete these are all the things we have learned it and apart from that one so we have learned and uh, we have used the firebase database and firebase thing so we have used the authentication module so how to uh, uh, auth authentication thing login user and all those things also we have learned it and apart from this one what we have did is so we have changed the security rules and we have deployed the project and all those things we have seen it so these are all the different concepts which you have learned in the Vue.js composition api if you want to learn about the options api we have also the playlist in view 3 about the options api you can go to our view 3 complete playlist complete play store view 3 you will be able to see somewhere 118 videos will be there somewhere here it will be hiding yeah here so one total of UJS3 complete course tutorial here you will be having 118 videos so if you want you can learn this 118 videos so the same concepts will be same concepts will be covered here also but the entire concepts will be doing it in the Composition API. So the same thing we are having here 112 videos and this one we are having 1180 videos. Here instead of Pinia, we are using the UX state management pattern. So that's that is our difference between this thing. So after learning this Vue.js 3, so then what we need to learn? So next where we need to go. So you also have a server-side rendering code like Nuxt.js. 
we have a quasar quasar framework will be there so which you can uh, write the code and you can see it so this so if you want to build a career in vue js means so what i can do is so what i can tell is so we have an another one something like next js so you can go for the next js so we will do the playlist for this next js also but it will take some time so maybe vue js already we have covered a lot of concept playlist right so it will take some time to do this next js also so this next js is also initiative website framework so view js application with confidence using the next it so it supports the server side rendering thing so next js is there and also we have an another framework something like quasar so this is also one of the thing so you will get the quasar in astronomy so but this one is a quasar framework yeah here you can write it quasar.dev so enterprise ready cross platform view js framework this is also a view js framework enterprise ready so here you can use it so this one also one code base many integrations so here you can write it with the vue.js code in one integrate one view in vue.js and you can deploy it in all the platforms he is trying to say so you'll we'll also try to do this quasar also it will take some time for this one also in order to implement this quasar thing so this is these are the two things which if you want to extend your career in the vue.js framework means so these are the two things uh, you can make a note of this one apart from this one what i can say is in our leela web dev so we have also different types of playlists are there so which you want to get perfect in the front end development thing so you can take a look at my javascript basic things like javascript basics and ecma scripts and also you can if you want to master the dom means you can go to my javascript dom introduction and if you want to master in the ajax means you can go to the ajax thing so these are all the different types so if you want to master the angular as already who are my subscribers they are no so we have lot of content in the angular so you can take a look at this angular also typescript angular lot of things are there so that's it guys so i will come up with a new course in this one uh, the next course you will come with a new course most probably vue js will not be there so vue js i will take some couple of months break and afterwards we will start with uh, next js or quasar anything we will take this one and we will do a playlist so right now we will move on to the new thing so for just for our for me also to change and for our subscribers also for as a refreshment we will come with a new concept we will work on the new concept thing so if you want to master in the back end thing means so we have the back end thing also node js and also mongo db course is also there so you can take over this playlist also you can have it and if you want to learn about the html and css we have our playlist is css thing also so we have did in the flex grid everything we have did it in our css you can go to the css and you can check it and we also did uh, what i want to say html course html thing also we have did it so i don't know we, yeah here this is our playlist 53 videos are there and where this html gone so my my playlist also i am unable to identify where is my actual playlist and all those things yeah somewhere it will be there i think i don't think so where could me my html gone where is my html hypertext this is http protocol regular expression babel css floors i know somewhere yeah here html css no not this html yeah here this one so i forgot it yeah we are having 52 videos on html you can take a look at this html also html css and all those things so that's it guys so this is all about our vue.js things so i will come up with a new course soon so we will start it so i will not take too much of break so two days or three days we will start our new playlist i let me think what what is the things left behind almost all the front end development courses in our uh, channel i think we are the only guys so we are doing so much of content we have did it including the testing and all those things let me know your thoughts in the comments and all those things so let me know your suggestions uh, which one we need to do so if you want me to do something like any other courses uh, back end courses also if you want me to do so we will start we will do it so we have did so much lot of content in our front front end development thing consistently we have completed 3 years uh, with uh, in our channel also the leela web dev channel has completed 3 years but the subscribers are little bit less slow because of the communication problem and all those things so this so, so many so many things are there but uh, what i can say is the hard work and all those things what we have did is exceptional so that one is uh, what i can say so i believe in the hard work only so let's uh, continue the same phase, same pace we will do some more and more videos more and more concepts so that we i can learn and you can learn and everyone can learn 
so learning is the only thing in our software industry what i can say is learning is the only thing so which you can build your career enhance your career so that is up so improving you are improving the skills that is the main thing in our software industry that is the main thing what i can say so that is all the uh, that is all the things what i can say is so do the hard work so one day you will achieve the success so that is the thing so right now our channel 3 years is completed but we haven't achieved the success but okay fine so we have reached to one end so what we expected we haven't reached it but okay i am satisfied with that one so i can i i, I will not say that i am not satisfied okay i am satisfied but there is a lot of things we need to achieve it so we, we will do it so what i need is oh, only thing the support i need it so if you give me so much support from uh, from your end i will push the more and more front end development courses and also you'll start with the back end things and all those things like dot net everything so we will do it so we will learn and we will do it what is there so we can do it so that is the only thing we need to do it but the only thing what i want is the support so if you give me the support proper support and all those things so for me it will be a motivation why because so i am doing so many videos right so right now if you try to see here uh midnight 12 so midnight also midnight 12 it is there so daily i will be having so if you watch my playlist or videos or anything it will be around midnight 12 o'clock something like that so i am doing daily videos at this time of thing so if you give me support then i can do more and more videos like this so i can have some motivation like this so if i don't get any support or anything means so slowly i, I don't know so may, maybe i will be decreasing the videos like that but up to now i haven't decreased it i am going on the same phase so we'll see it that's it guys so i don't want to go more into the details of this one so just support me subscribe to my channel and uh, watch the videos so if you watch the videos only then only you can understand it so don't think that okay i know this i know this i know this like that some content will be there if you watch one video something new you will learn so that is the main thing so me also when i am watching other videos or anything and change i will watch the video why because if i know the concept also i'll watch it why because so maybe i can find a new content there so new concept maybe i can find if i know if i know also that content maybe in a new way i can understand or new content i can learn it new concept i can learn it like that i will see so there is don't think that i know everything so learn it then only you will get the success that's it guys so if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and uh, please uh, if you want to see my videos prior to the release also i have a membership you can join it right now the some of my videos if you try to see here here the videos are not in the membership so some of my videos are in the membership in this one at the time if you try to see here only 110 videos are released already the 11 uh, this video and this video are already been released so this one is released 54 minutes back only but these two videos will be already released so but it will take some time so membership videos are also there in my channel so if you want to join as a membership so you can join it and you can you can see my videos which are in the membership thing so that's it guys so <clears throat> please support my channel by subscribing to this channel so that i will be posting more and more front end development courses thank you